What's up everybody, I'm Ross and welcome to another Lost Ark video. In this video I'm going to walk you through the newest event in Lost Ark, the Heartbeat Island event. Heartbeat Island event works pretty much as all the island events work. Doing different activities will reward you with festival coins, which you can then use at the Festival Coin Exchange NPC found in every one of the main cities and on the Heartbeat Island to purchase items each week. I didn't find the ending date for this event, but it will probably last for a month and I'll go through the things you can purchase later in the video. Heartbeat Island is located just outside of Anika and it's always available during this event. After you have visited it once, you can then use the ocean liner fast travel to get to the island instantly. Once you get to the island, you'll have a small introductionary quest which will reward you with festival coins and unlock three repeatable daily yellow quests. Each of these quests will reward you with 100 festival coins and they are rather easy because all you have to do is to go to the designated location and just stay there for three minutes. There is also two different cooperative quests each hour. In the first one you have to do this way and Umarka dance 20 times and in the second quest a boss will appear that you have to take down. I wasn't rewarded festival coins in the second quest so I'm not sure if you can only do one of them each hour or did I do something wrong against the boss. I mean apparently there are some light sticks at the bottom of the fight area that you might need to pick up to fight the boss but that shouldn't really be a problem because you'll get festival coins via other means constantly as chaos dungeons and guardian raids also reward you with festival coins and these coins are usable across your roster. It might be a good idea to leave one of your alts on this island so you can easily do the hourly cooperative quest and get festival coins easily. The things you can use the festival coins to purchase are your standard event items. There's a cosmetic item for your head slot, this time it's pit up hat, headband skin, legendary card bag, summer cocktail, legendary wrap paw selection chest, Yuna's task instant completion pass and daily quest plus one, card XP, legendary to rare card packs, silver, skill tree effect transfer boost and honing success rate boosts. There are also all the honing materials for various tiers available. And that's about it. All you need to know about the Heartbeat Island event. Let me know in the comments what you think about this event because it seems that a lot of people don't really like this one. Make sure to like and subscribe for more Lost Ark content and thank you for watching, have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video.